Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you're unable to install this update that is KB5068861. Because of this error, that is your device is missing important security updates. So if you're receiving this error, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to run these commands. These commands are provided in the video description. Type in CMD in Windows search box, make a right click on command prompt app. Make sure that you run command prompt as an administrator only. Click on yes to allow. Now copy the first command. All these commands are provided in the video description. Paste it over here, hit the enter key. And let the process complete. Uh, this will run a scan. Once the scan is 100% complete, in my case, it is already done. So once it is 100% complete, copy the second command. And then paste it on the same window, hit the enter key. Now, once the second scan is 100% complete, then copy the third command and then paste it on the same window. And once the third scan is 100% complete, then restart your computer. And after the system restart, you can update your Windows 11 once again. Still not working, pause and restart the update. Now for this, you can go to Windows Update in Windows Settings. And over here, you can see Pause option, hit Pause over here. And once paused, click on Resume Updates and check. Still not working, start these services. Now for this, type in Services in Windows Search box and then click on Services. Now find app readiness in services. So make a double click on app readiness, set this to automatic. Click on apply, click on start if highlighted. Click on okay, make a right click on app readiness, click on restart. Now find background intelligent transfer service, make a, make a double click, set this to automatic. Click on apply, click on start if highlighted. Now make a right click on background intelligent transfer service, then click on restart. Now once done, find windows update, scroll down here you can see windows update, make a double click, set this to automatic, click on apply, click on start if highlighted, then click on ok, make a right click on windows update and then click on restart. Now you can check, still not working, the next step is to Use Microsoft Update Catalog. Now for this, you can open this link in a browser. It will take you to Microsoft website. Now over here, write down the name of the update that is KB5068861 over here. Yeah. And then click on search over here. Now check your version. So type in WINVER in Windows search box. Click on WINVER run command. And in my case, it's version 2.5H2. So now open Windows settings, go to system, and scroll down, go to about option. And then over here, check the system type. So in my case, it's 64-bit operating system. Now for me, it's Windows 11 version 2.5H2 x64 base system. Now if you have Windows 11 version 24H2 x64, then this is the right one for you. For me, this is the right one. Now click on download and then click on this update KB5068861. Click on it and then let the download complete. Once the download is complete, you can click on this file and just follow the on screen instruction and then you can up install this update manually using this file. And once done, restart your computer and after the system restart, you can check. Still not working. Use fix problems using Windows Update for this open Windows settings. Go to Windows Update and then go to Advanced option over here. Scroll down, go to Recovery option. Here you can see fix problems using Windows Update. This will reinstall your current version of Windows. Your apps, files and settings will be preserved. So click on Reinstall now. This process will take some time. And once this is done, uh, you can restart your computer and then update your Windows 11. The last step is to use media creation tool. Now for this, you can go to this website, scroll down here, you can see media creation tool, click on download now, and then you can run this exe file. Run this exe file, and then you have to click on accept over here. By default, Windows 11 will be selected, click on next, select ISO file over here, and then click on next, save it to desktop, save. Let the download complete, this process will take some time. Once done, click on finish option, and once you hit finish, let this close automatically. 
do not close this manually it will take few seconds or maybe a minute to close now go to desktop make a double double click on windows iso file make a double click on setup file click on yes to allow click on next click on accept and here you can see ready to install by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer so make sure this is checked hit install after the installation uh, you can this process will take time once done log into the computer and then you can update your windows 11 so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to install this update successfully on your windows 11 computer so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel